I'm Simon Chowdhury. It's Sunday, March 15th, and here are your headlines from 7 Action News. State health officials have now confirmed at least 33 cases of the coronavirus. Michigan State University says one case involved someone, quote, related to our MSU community. Another case, a staff member at Osborne High School in Detroit. They have tested positive for the virus. The school says it will be reaching out to families of students with more information about that case. An EMS worker in River Rouge has also tested positive for COVID-19. The city's public safety director says the worker went home sick last Sunday after an ambulance run. He tells us the worker had limited contact with city employees and other people, and the Wayne County Health Department was immediately notified. The public safety director says city employees have been told to report any symptoms. Business owners in Detroit say they're feeling the impact after today's St. Patrick's Parade was canceled in Corktown. The event was called off because of coronavirus fears. Many restaurant and bar owners say they spent thousands of dollars on food and drinks that may, may now go wasted. Some businesses are open today, but they are complying with the governor's order and can only have less than 250 people. Hallie. All right, thanks, Simo. We'll see some sunshine on our Sunday. Nice finish to the weekend overall. Our temperatures in the low 40s, certainly running a little bit below average in a cool or even chilly overnight. 20s for lows under a mostly clear sky. We'll cloud up during the day tomorrow. So as we see more clouds, a chance for an overnight rain shower Monday night into Tuesday. Tuesday, we're back to near or just above 50 degrees on St. Patrick's Day. We take a step back in temperatures on Wednesday. It's more rain that we'll be watching Thursday and Friday. And as concerns over the coronavirus grow, Kroger and Walmart are changing their hours. Kroger says its stores will be open from 7 a.m. to 9 p.m. Walmart said that 24-hour stores will now be open from 6 in the morning until 11 at night. But Walmart stores that are not open 24 hours will keep their regular schedules. The reduced hours will allow employees to restock shelves and clean stores. Remember, you can watch us 24-7 on your favorite streaming devices, including Roku, Amazon Fire TV, Apple TV, and Android TV. Just search for WXYZ.com and add the channel. Have a great day.